All right, so this is gonna be the first part of Until Dawn. I hope I'll be able to uh, clear the whole game in three parts. So just a few disclaimer first. Uh, I played the game for the first time um, last week, really enjoyed it. And uh, just as a word of warning, uh, there is gore, there is uh, people that are dying, there's... Uh, it's a violent game, there's jump scares, there's blood, there's all, all the bad thing you can uh, you can expect from a uh, from a horror game. And since I cannot say the word horror, I'm gonna say scary game from now on. So, in that game, the choices you make really impact, well, at least, at least that's what I've heard, really impact the outcome of the story. So, I will try to do some uh, different choices uh, from my first uh, playthrough. So, uh, I think I, I've said all the, the things I wanted to say. Let's, uh, let's start. Let's start the, the game. Uh, starting a new story will overwrite. Uh, yeah, okay, I, it's fine. Yes, I want to. I want to do a new story. Smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Also, uh, just tell me if the voice and sound is not well balanced. I didn't make uh, that much test. Hey, Derry! Hi, hi! Happy to see you here. Uh, did you play Until Dawn before? To say play is kind of a big word. No, I know nothing about it. Yeah, well, you're in for a treat. This is like a horror movie where we will uh, choose some decisions. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh. Don't you guys think this is a little bit wrong? Oh, come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. It's a bit confusing at the start, but it, it all makes sense uh, when you get to know the characters better. about to see something incredibly cruel. Mike. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey Hannah. Teenagers are dumb. Yeah, that's that's how it works. Sorry for teenagers, but it is what it is. Hey, did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh! So right now I'm quote-unquote playing. The movement is quite uh, rigid. If you've ever played uh, the old Resident Evil game, that's kind of how it controls. Yeah, I don't need the tutorial. I've played this once can grab object and look at them. Seems he had Jeez, a great Josh. hunting. 
Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. Right. Anna, you look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you've even you're even better without it. Come to the guest at two a.m., Mike. Oh my God! I what expected did our him to be dead. Get into now? Yeah, that's a lot of booze. I got your note. Glad you can make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out. And see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt? Yep, with the camera and all. What are you doing it's here? Great, huh? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all good. Oh, what? Just a stupid prank. Uh. uh hey. You guys are jerks. You know that? And that will trigger a whole lot of bad stuff. Okay, so w now we have to make some choices. So, find others, wake Josh. Uh, I'm gonna go with uh, find others. Guys, there's someone outside. What the hell? Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. Yeah, it was just a little joke. What did you do? Joke. We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Yeah, just the biggest humiliation Hannah! ever. So it's, it's, it's fine. Should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. <sighs> oh, shit! So we have QTEs. <sighs> I'm fine with those. I've played Resident Evil 4 before. I'm gonna go with fast. It's an emergency. The gameplay you're seeing right now is pretty much uh, the gameplay we're gonna get. It, it's not. It's it's not a game you don't you know pressing buttons. It's all about Hello? the story. Hello? The story is amazing though. Okay, those are kind of giving you tips or you know some hints about our future. Like it, it won't end well. can change the future. It's like hints or tips. Huh? Hannah! It's already that? pretty scary. Good suspense so far. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh dearie! <laughs> oh Hannah. man, it, it, it's gonna be... Hannah. So much Hello? more. So much more. Hannah! Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. <laughs> Hannah? Back? <gasps> Oh. oh, Jesus Christ! 
Ah, uh, yeah. No way I'm dropping mana. I did the same thing the first time. I'm so sorry! Oh no! The oh, shit. That's not what I wanted to do at all. Oh well. I'm gonna see something different. I mean, truth be told, uh, it's the same thing that happened if you just let go and fall with Anna. But I, uh, this is not what I wanted to do. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is Yeah, twice actually. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Yeah, yes, I could restart now, for sure. All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. All right. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Yeah, well, I I'm going to be honest. So, uh, Makes me feel a bit uneasy okay. because of the. Uh, is good. What do you think? Uh, how do you call it? A scarecrow? Makes you feel uneasy. Uh, the scarecrow. If it wasn't for oh, that, it would be fine. I see. Let's see. I irrationally the hate this guy. You're gonna be able there. to hate him more later. There on your own for a period of time. Let's say a week, for example. A week there. Yeah, I mean, depends if there's a uh, internet. Um, I, I would say I wouldn't. I, I did. I would last Why time. Uh, I, w I would say I'd be. I'd be uh, f for a week. I guess I'd be lonely. I, there's a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. Perhaps. This is something we can explore in the future. Hmm? I guess our time I'm is up. I'm afraid we're out of time. Yeah. <laughs> not for now. Until our next session. And uh, until then, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that makes you feel safe. <laughs> I'm afraid that won't work here. Things are gonna get so bad. Like, imagine the worst, and you'll be quite far from the reality. And you know, after the song uh, in the opening of Dismantled, it's another game with uh, great music tracks. Hey, Caraldor. Hello. I'm afraid this won't be an action game either. But there's more action than in Journey. A lot more action than Journey.
Oh yeah, the opening video is good. I mean, it's it's all good and it's all looking like an opening video in a way. It's like a movie. It's really good. Uh, I don't play games twice in the same week very often. And I was really looking forward to replay this. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. The opening reminded me of a game I tried on iOS, but I don't grounds, remember what it was the called. Themselves couldn't have made it that Dark far. Gloomy beginning Something about that mountain seems to with a light More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah. Life and Beth is Washington. strange, maybe. Well, no, it's... hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. So this and guy I, is the brother of the two, uh, of the twins that died in the beginning. So much to Hannah and Beth just that to make we're, sure, we're all uh, still here together. We're all on the same them. page. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for... For the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so, let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, alright? I never yes! did a party where I was a fucking porn star. Does not, not know what happened. No, 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 because he was passed out. No, he knows what happened. Uh, he wasn't did passed out. But no, no, he, he knows. Oh yeah, the mu the music is is fantastic. I mean, the visuals are great for a PS4 game from 2016, I think. That, that's pretty good. Um, I, I was I was impressed. Uh, I really enjoyed it. And I'm happy to play it again with some people. Too bad I don't have a game console. I don't know if it's an exclusive. We're gonna be fine. Sam, Anna's best friend. She, she's uh, she's quite the athlete. We'll keep it at that. Hello? Someone there? So to go to the um, to the the chalet, chalet. I don't know how you say that. To go to the mansion, we need to take a cable car because it's at the top of a mountain. That's what we are trying to do right now. Wow, 
What? The gate's busted. <sighs> Climb over, Chris. Yup, yeah, like you said, Sam. Damn it. Uh, we're gonna go quick because she's an athlete. She's very good at climbing. <sighs> As long as I do the QTEs. Gonna jump. I'm telling you she's good. I need to not move the controller. <laughs> Cutie. That's gonna be quite relevant later on. So this is the totem, when you pick up them up, they're telling you like uh, some warning about what's to come in the game. So yeah, they, they're giving us a possible future, but we can, uh, we can change it depending on the choices we make. This is not helping me at all. Throughout the game, very few times were those totems helpful. Maybe I'm just not smart enough to uh, to understand them. The past is beyond our control. It's true. There is saying lol, my first thought was to take a screenshot to refer back to habits, yeah. Max here, where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello, what do we have here? So, the first time I chose to answer the phone. This time I will choose to uh not. Maybe I shouldn't poke around Chris and stuff. So see we just now we had a butterfly effect, so Chris? this will Sam, change hey, the story hey. at some point. Chris has a crush on Ashley. It's a great character, I like how he, he evolved through, through the game. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. What happened when mind. you answered? Yeah, he, he he's seeing her answer and teases her about uh, being too nosy and stuff. But I don't know how oh, it impact this. the 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 rest he of the dies. story. It's hard to say. You think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh come on! This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Sure, nobody will come here. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. All right, some gameplay. <laughs> 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 
it doesn't control like super good. It's not that. Um, it's not a shooter. We'll put it. Wow, that way. nice shooting text. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, no, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. So now we can choose. We can choose to shoot the squirrel or not. And the game is teaching us that sometimes doing <laughs> nothing shot. is an option. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Or a wild case of who in talent. <laughs> oh, I'm not that great of a gamer, to be honest. I just love games. Right now I'm controlling the, the dude. You get to control every character. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here it just all came flooding back. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. I have the key. For you. Oh, real gentleman. Uh, what can we do here? And I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? Our devices. I down. missed a bit with um. It's so beautiful in the day, but at night just feels. Like a messy. sanatorium. It, it's gonna it's be great. Giant. I I messed what around a, a bit with the setting of the game house. to uh, balance no the voice and my rich. voice. Uh, I feel maybe I'm wrong. I feel the characters' voices are a bit low, and since it's the principal thing we need to hear, just tell me if uh, if I should give the the, the characters in game more uh, more voice volume. Phone's ringing. Yeah, well, I was gonna Be stay back. here and catch some disease, but okay. I'm just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. You know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front where I was sitting. Okay, so. So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Wow. 
boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. All right, sorry, I just had a phone call. It was my mum. Yeah, it's it's a horror mystery game, but it's definitely more horror than uh, than mystery. I'm gonna go give um, I'm gonna go give our uh, characters just a bit more uh, more volume. There. Let's hope it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be better. Thanks for letting me know. And yeah, uh, let the caption. Oh, well, phone what call again. Hell? Guess it's Jess. my mom. Hey. Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look. I got a lot of meat on my bones. All right, back so again. Muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey. <laughs> well, well, well. What do we have Chris. here? Chris. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Uh I'll take that. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Do the twins come back as zombies or something? Seriously, well, couldn't they have built the lodge, like, right where the cable car ends? I, uh... Yeah, she's Mike's ex, so that's gonna have some tension between Jessica and Emily, of course. And now she's with Matt. Um, and yeah, uh, I I know quite a bit about the story, but I won't spoil. I, uh, been like I won't crazy. spoil. It. I won't say yes or no. So Matt, he's Emily's new boyfriend. You know. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Yeah, well. There's no bellboy, you're... You're in a private place in the mountain. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost Not in there. a resort. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. I mean, what do you think? <laughs> oh, Jesus! Ah, <laughs> oh, Mike, Mike. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Well, gonna the be woods. violence. Spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Right, let, let's try to be Michael, a pacifist. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya! Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah. I was already taking All them. the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. 
okay? Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Let's be a pacifist again. All right. All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. She's totally over Mike. Right? This is Ashley. She has cross on, uh, crush on Chris, the dude with the glasses. Uh uh. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly, and not in the friend zone kind of way. I might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! oh God. <laughs> hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Uh, First time I was super honest, uh, I, I will try to um, not make him look. Yeah, just to see. kind of busted. It's not It's not like really interesting. It's just... What? <laughs> For real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. Yeah, no, uh, it's, it's busted. Uh, no, really, Matt, it's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it, so just no. No. All right. Uh, sure, if you say so. So we had a butterfly effect, so it seems it's going to change something. It's hard to, to say what. Our new, bio uh, our new boyfriend seems better, though. Yeah, I kind of agree there, but uh, Mike uh, is is cooler than, than he looks. Let's put it that way. He, he, he's having great, uh, character oh, development. You did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Let's grab a snowball, too. Well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh! Praise. <laughs> hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh! Ah! Hey! Oh, snap! I'm good at snow fights. <laughs> In case Hello? it's not obvious, the game is teaching me how to play. Hey, this is gonna be handy, handy Ooh, later on like for uh, <laughs> much <me>. more important <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Sometimes doing nothing you can't hide is the me, right Michael. thing to do. I know all your tricks. Let's do nothing. And then what? Oh, ho. no more. Oh, oh yeah, oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done. City. So did I go down? Uh, Done. City. So. We've we've hit him <laughs> all the time, and he so didn't touch us once. All right. All right. My my. 
So are we We've calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Let's kiss Mike. The war is over. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, another appointment to the psychi psychiatrist. And how are we feeling? It's going pretty well. Nothing too scary for now. I trust that you have stayed in the company of good friends since our last session. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. All right. Well, uh, I don't know. Uh, there's. Let Let's go. Let's say women are worrying to me. It's not, you know, it's not the case. But. Uh, I'm more afraid of planes. That's for sure. Uh, definitely more f afraid of heights because uh, I'm okay. I'm an okay swimmer. Snakes. Who is is he talking to? You you will find out uh, tomorrow. Uh, well, yeah, well, I mean, guns can do quite a bit of damage. Although knives are pretty uh, pretty bad too. Uh, snakes. Uh, yeah, w you'll find out. I cannot answer who's the psychiatrist is talking to. Uh, well, I mean, scarecrows are more frightening to me, but uh, this clown is quite frightening. We'll go with the clowns. You'll probably miss tomorrow. Oh, man. Uh, well, it's gonna be on, on YouTube. Uh, I'll tell you uh, uh, privately, let's say. Uh, I, wait, well, gore is more disgusting than crows. <laughs> Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Oh, spiders, for sure. Uh, gore. I'm, I'm fine with needles. Let, let's keep clowns. Just to see if it makes any difference. Uh, yeah, gore. Gore. Storms are fine. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligent. <laughs> Spiders, clowns, an awful. Ooh. <laughs> That's some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but promise we'll talk again very soon all right 
little recap. We're we're gonna get this uh, before every uh, every chapters. Don't you guys think this is a little bit? Oh come on, she deserves it. Hannah, what's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters. Oh, we will never forget. Sam. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. So, I got moved to the back. And next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? Alright, nine hours until to to me. Josh. He's uh, the twins that die in the beginning, brother. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oh, Oops. that's a shame. Hey, gang. You guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could've done with some bellboys, but uh, hey. Can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy, though. I mean, it's just really weird being back here. Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Uh. Let's let's ask him. He's, he's, hey. he's fine. You doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be like a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey. True. Not if I don't report you. Um. <laughs> Lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Uh, let's say, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird to be back. Y you doing all right? Yeah, aside from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. All right. No. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that Parker creepy. right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Yeah, stop that. Dude, hey, that's, that's kind of weird. Out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not going to bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some I don't blood like flowing Josh. down there. <laughs> Very yeah. much. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You, The first Ashley, time and now, too, I kind of feel you weird when they say, hey, look around, there's not any parents. Gentleman. Those people now, look like they're in you their come 20s. In for the kill. No? Yeah, I don't, I don't know, dude. I don't like I that. don't know, man. He sounds drunk, yeah. Know. What if it's like yeah, weird? True. What if she, well, we know he's she kind like, of a big drinker. I want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that. I mean, weren't you just listening? You got to buck up, bro. Grow up here. I mean, I... <laughs> yeah, so Carol Dorr saying, yeah, it's weird about the parents. Lunch, I thought it was weird because I, I feel they're like 25. You sounded like you had a plan. You I'm like, man, they probably have their own uh, apartments, maybe even houses. Off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh shoot, nobody likes cool buns. 
she sounds like a creep as well, but also drunk. A drunk creep. Yeah, it's not that great of a of a combo. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Right, let's go in and unlock that door. I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I don't think so. Here, use this. Great. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on, it's a can. Oh, yeah, now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep, ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. <laughs> Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm oh, I know the go twins' ghosts are going to come back for revenge. For we'll yep, see. Do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. I can tell you I've got uh, quite a few surprises along the way in my first uh, playthrough. That's for sure. Guess we uh, we need to be careful with that spray can. That's that's what I that's what I get. All right, so we need to go to the bathroom. If I remember correctly, it's upstairs. Huh. That's cool. No, any games like this on iOS that have huh? butterfly effects? Ah. I can't think of any. That? I believe that Life is Strange is kind of like that, but I haven't played it. It's on my radar. Actually, I've um, put a reservation on it. Uh, because Life is Strange is on the PS4 too. So I've uh, put a reservation for Life is Strange on PS4 at my local library. I'm telling you kids. Go visit your local library. There, uh, you can borrow games for free. That's what I did with Until Dawn and Journey, and Shenmue, and Resident Evil Seven. Like it? I have the game up to a month. It doesn't cost me a dime. We even, uh, I say we because I am working at, you know, I am a librarian, for those who don't know. I'm working there, but we uh, we don't even have any now uh, late fees when you uh, bring back your stuff late. There used to be some uh, fees and now there's not even that, so it's very, very free. Ah! Get the <laughs> it's, it startled me even ah. though I knew about that. Yeah, Lifeline. <sighs> Perfect. Uh, there is saying there's an old series that just text that is just text We're called Lifeline. Our buns off out here. You can play on Apple Watch. Yeah, I, I actually I bought there's a new Lifeline that just came out uh, last week. I bought it. I just haven't have time to, to play <sighs> it yet. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> Jeez. Ah. <laughs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What 
was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby wolverine. I would need to go baby. look at the Don't laundry. Worry, buddy. Be, a big boy be back soon. in a second. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face? All right, I'm back. Yeah, I'm back. Oh, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Yeah, Hound's life me? is strange. Did you say something? Oh, did you? I'm not curious. Hear me? Was your I guess I'll too loud? discover Sounds it. Sounds uh, like someone's bitter. She didn't soon make enough. Cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Uh, let's side with, uh, with hey, M. You're making everyone time. uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you, too. Hey, that's, that's uncalled. Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck it's on that months. when you're trying to right. sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. It was good, but I serious? think I got stuck you somewhere think along that's the insulting? way. I haven't been back. All right. Or something. Okay, stop. Jessica, now. you need to shut your mouth, okay? No. You're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. I'm about to get right up in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am down to get real. Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, Drinking why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told it's you about? pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> yep, let's go to a cabin far well, away from, yeah. from the mansion. That's great. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got She's the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling really. all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. What a great idea. In this place without uh, electricity. Ah, <sighs> exiled. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. Ah, uh, young Arr. couples. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right, oh and maybe my. you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! You're gonna need these. Porn star? I pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out. What like a that. creep. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. Alright. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. 
Okay. Just is flirting with, with everybody. Us? Wait, really? What? No. All right, to the cabin we go. This is gonna be our last uh, thing we're gonna do today. I didn't plan to. Um hey, Hot Lips, photo booth. I All didn't right, plan to do this, mind. but I'd like an opportunity for an hour or so. Okay. I thought it would help me for tomorrow. I did better than the first time. Guess she won't be happy. Good effort. Next time I get the camera, okay? Well, okay, but thanks it's for not streaming. Hey, it's my pleasure. I really wanted to experience the game again time. with <laughs> okay. some people to Let's uh, go. I've got cabin fever. to share the experience with. And I think it's a great streaming game because it's basically a movie. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And the story is very that? good. I, I know, uh, like, I it starts, in mind. definitely starts slow. Get to know the characters and the locations. But uh, once once bad stuff start kicking in, it's it's something. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Hey, whoa. We, we don't. Uh, we don't wish yeah, for people's she's a death. But maybe ease cool. up on her. She's still kind of torn up from being dumb. Um, hello. Not my problem, Mike, and not yours either. Yeah, no, they no, just I leave, mean, leave of course her house. I'm just this. saying it's... Like, it's not worth kicking her when she's down. Because I'd much rather spend my time getting down with you. You see, you see what I I did there? I oh, yeah, I see it. did that for you. Yeah, okay. But she better stay down is all I'm saying. Ooh, gameplay. Huh. I guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? I pressed the button. Mike, wouldn't it be nice to fire up the Jenny and get moving? What's a Jenny? Yikes. Poor Ashley. Gonna get punched by a clown. All right, let's see. Boom! Nice one, Mikey. All right. Woo! You are a wizard. We're fine. Walking in the woods, all alone, without any weapon. Zam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. No, this is awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. <laughs> it up well they never closed the investigation okay I'm getting the creeps now 
It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Oh, you did something well, very what stupid. What I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, yes. I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Nah. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? Yeah. It was just the biggest humiliation ever. Who could have thought she would leave? After all, they're they're just like 25 years old teenagers. What did they know? Um, did you hear that? I heard something. Yeah. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still Gonna have need to all watch the rest on YouTube later. Oh yeah, totally. Uh, yeah. And the more it, it's going uh, on, I don't know. you know, the more the story goes on, the more you get to know the characters, and the more uh, interesting it gets. I'm I'm feeling heroic. I'm gonna right, jump. Down. After you. Just stay put. And we just had a butter. <laughs> and there were just that creepy dude. Hey, handsome. Wanna help me move this cart thing? <sighs> Help me move it, help me move it. Oh, gameplay, I pressed the button. Uh, I imagined us grunting together. This is not what I pictured. Uh. All right. I missed Crap. the QTE Ugh. the first time. Oh my gosh, are you okay? When you're not expecting uh, it, it's kind of uh Yeah. You know, you're just yep. watching the characters walk and, and then it's like, oh man, I need to press that button quick. Uh oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? We'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Uh, now I kind of don't remember. This is no, I don't want to see that again. Never mind. cannot get like very lost in that game it's very much on uh, on rails but sometimes the um, the camera changes the the direction and more often than one I was like did I came just from there or is it the place I need to go ah! Ah! <sighs> you all right uh, yeah close one I don't think this place is up to code yeah, I'm thinking it's time think so. to go. Danger. Jesus. This place is a real fixer upper. Well said, Mike. Oh, 
almost there. Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Eh, I'm gonna take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for this. Oh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. I don't see anybody. She's crazy. Uh, like it's one of those times. Okay, there. Mike is quite a gentleman. Answering his mating call. Wow, <laughs> you're easy. Yeah, you got a lot of love to give. <laughs> you're scared. Cabin. <sighs> God damn it, Josh. Couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Who is Debbie Downer? <laughs> Just oh, admit I have no idea. Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Oh, it's no, it's no <gasps> fight, too. Judgment Day. Okay. Okay. Well, if that's how it's gonna be. Yes. Sammy. What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh. Well, I was just. Getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Yeah, Hardy sure, hard. Josh. My God, this dude. Come on. All right, Josh. Let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Well, this is kind of where I wanted to stop, to be honest. Um, but I thought it would be the that? end of the chapter. Seems it's not. I would have loved to uh, end the chapter. Yeah, she she's weird, like taking a bath when there's no, there's no not even the lights are working. It's like, man. You, you have some weird uh, priorities. Where are the stairs to go down now?
what? Okay, well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. A what? Wow, you have a spirit board? Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Well, yeah, you lights. just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Rash, Come on, Chris. You know you want to spend time with Ashley. Yep, for a ride along. This is what all the 25ers likes to, to do. How I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Oh yeah, I now see I was what you did there. Use some alone time. You're a genius. Let's. Uh, they are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need like something to bond over. You know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. We're here for you, even Josh, though you're a creep. We're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through Careful, service. Sam, about Together. those uh, promises. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. I had, I had the hardest time here on my first playthrough. I didn't understand the mechanics and it was super easy. Sorry I just to needed drag to you listen down into more. The bowels, oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Here, can you, can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. All right, let's not move. It's pretty easy, to be honest. Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. I pressed the button. And now I need the lights. Yeah, I was, I was pressed. I the more button like it. too soon and I <laughs> All right. understood why Bye, it girl. wasn't working and I missed the QTEs. Oh well. Not touching Josh's hand is uh, maybe not that bad. What the hell's that? It gave a butterfly effect that though. It could be a lot of things. None of them nice. I quit it. <laughs> I'm just, just joshing you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you were really freaked out. I wasn't scared. I was not scared. No, no, you just jumped because you wanted to squeeze in some aerobics. 
Yeah, she's quite athletic. Don't be an a-hole, okay? I totally didn't jump. All I said was, what was that? Which is a totally normal reaction to hearing a super creepy noise in a super creepy basement. <laughs> regular about it. Fitting here. I want to go today. check it out. What? Why? <laughs> what do you care for any face? No, it's, it's probably just like not anything. Uh, why don't you hold down the floor while I make sure? Okay, whatever you say, madam. Getting so hooked on that. this. Yeah, it's, it's all this cool it's very good. Holy crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said. Nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! Yeah, well, that's why she need a bat. So What bad. in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oi, 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 oi. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You we know call what? that Ouija you know no, no. here. That, I've just that game. Been through enough spooking for I don't one know night, if okay? I see a hot bat you call it my that crystal way. ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. All right. I think uh, I did it. This room is getting quite creepy. We're gonna do uh, the psychiatrist thing and then uh, we'll call it a day. Quite happy with uh, with the stream. I would like to understand your feelings toward people with fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Uh, yeah, I kind of do. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? I'm not playing that much. I pressed like three buttons, dude. The game is kind of playing itself. I don't want to be mean. Or and now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. <laughs> well, you're a Which better tester than me, Kara. most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? Uh, I think honesty is, is better. So, you I would guess. tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty, then, and charity? Uh... I guess I'll keep with valuing honesty. <laughs> Charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Huh? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. All right, that's gonna be it for we'll today. Talk again soon. Thanks for watching, and uh, tomorrow it's gonna be a lot of uh, until dawn. So happy to have you with me. Have a
and uh, yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching. Bye. It was just a prank, Han. Today is the uh, for the same time, uh, the yeah, it will probably be around uh, twins who are still uh, 1 p.m. And I'm gonna try so and play this Hannah up until the, we're, the we're end of the game. Together. That's the plan. Of them. So see you tomorrow, hopefully, Whoa, and if you miss it, Somebody's I'm gonna upload it all on YouTube anyway. Butterfly effect. So uh, yeah, me? Did you this time is real. Oh, did Thanks. You Thanks for not watching. Hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. yeah. All right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. But watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Jess? <coughs> Jess! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions. Drop them.